that make them sad? Since I had the opportunity to talk for a change. <laughs> I'm ignoring them. I just want to say I want to welcome everybody that can make it here tonight, uh, today. And uh, we're happy to have everybody here from far and near. Um, I want to say how blessed we are to have three lovely children, two daughter-in-laws, and two grandchildren, and how happy they have made us in all these years. And now that I'm through talking, she can... <laughs> Okay, 50 years ago, to a very shy young man, after we were sitting on the couch, it was 3 o'clock in the morning, and he said to me, after dating him exclusively for six months, he said to me, he said, Deb, would you like to go steady? I said, we've been going steady. <laughs> then all of a sudden, I see there's a little box there, and I said to him, yes. <laughs> Especially when I opened it up, I said, yes, yes, yes. And then he left. And I went in, and my mother was sad asleep, and I walked in, and I said, Mom, I need to tell you. She said, what's the matter? What's wrong? I said, Mom, I said, I just I became engaged. She said, to who? I said, what do you mean to who? To Harry. Well, anyway, so I showed her the ring. I'll tell a very short version. I showed her the ring, and she's all saying, she says, you know, it doesn't shine. It's probably not real. <laughs> I said, my wish me smart. I said, it'll be fine. So we called my sister, who promptly kept throwing me up because she was so excited. All right. So anyway, that night we had dinner at Shirley, and we didn't talk to Harry because we weren't too sure about the ring. And I worked in, I worked in Cosman. So my mother said, we'll go into Cosman the first thing in the morning and talk to the jeweler. So we're on the bus, and she put her hand over my ring, so if it was real, nobody would take the ring. So we got to Cosman's, and it's 9.30, and my mother never said muscle talk, which means congratulations, all right? So we go to the jewelers, and my mother puts my hand across the case, and she said to the jeweler, is it real? And he looked up and he said, it's real. My mother said, muscle talk. <laughs> <laughs> so I always had a dream that I would be married by Prince Charming, and he came. Oh. Oh. And he is. Oh. Oh. And then we've been very. <laughs> and then we've been very, very lucky to have three wonderful kids. So it's married to two wonderful, two wonderful girls. I was <laughs> and to have two of the most perfect grandchildren, please God, there'll be more in this world. Okay, thank everybody for coming, and we're just thrilled to have all of you here. Because every one of you are played a part in our lives, and may you all continue. Karen, say something. Karen, thank you.